goes up and it goes down I know my mom taught me that I figured why we fool around So little And we keep track of time Being so serious Idiots Thinking it will matter Keep me company downtown Before the clock runs out Sun is shining but the rain is welcome too Friends are nearby, don't need another view Time is not on my mind but then it's you Oh, I love it when the love comes around and then Welcome I back remember. to my channel. I just All finished getting ready for the day which never happens. I got the best sleep last night which hasn't happened in a long time. Um, I think I told you guys in my last vlog that Trey's going through his four month sleep regression and he still does sleep in a room in a bassinet. So getting sleep is a little difficult for me with having a three month old, almost four month old now. I never really thought about using like a sound machine. Sometimes like I would just try and put like the fan on in the bathroom to fall asleep. But y'all know that both of my older boys have the hatch, which I swear by I've always, like for years I've talked about their hatch machines. They are honestly just like the best sound machines. And I recently got one for me which was so needed and I don't know why I waited this long to get it, honestly. I have the Restore. Um, so it's right here. How cute is she? She's got the time right there. Like, I love this. She's so cute. And she helped both me and Alex get a great night's sleep last night. And I think Trey was really into it. I So for Trey, usually I'll turn on like some kind of like um, white noise or something like that but last night I used my restore and I put on the um, uh, the rain so they have like a bunch of different sounds that you can put on this has um, a light all these different colors you can choose from and then there's like dimming options so you can have it bright you can have it um, like really low I love having the light on I put it on like like a deep orange and I leave the light on so that I can see Trey and I can pick him up and nurse him put him back down and everything like that I love having a like a night light for my room the cool thing about the restore though is there's customized sleep methods for better sleep so you can have like a wind down option it'll play certain sounds um, to wind down for the night before you go to sleep and then once you go to sleep it'll have like you know whatever sound you like most for sleep or you can have the cycles change throughout the night so it'll play like different sounds throughout the night and then another great thing about this alarm is it has a gradual sunrise alarm so it's not like some loud annoying alarm like right in your face in the morning it gradually will wake you up i still have to take this little sticker off but all you have to do is just press that button on the side there is like the volume so turn it up turn it down you have the dimmer right here again I don't know why it took me so long to get the hatch for myself because I've always sworn by it for my kids um, like Cam and Quentin have both used there since they were babies they still use it to this day and Cam is going on like seven years old and he still loves it um, and I also love that it connects to your phone so you download the hatch app and I have all three of um, our sound machines on the app so I've got Camden's I've got Quentin's and then now I have mine and you can change the sounds you can change the lighting um, all of that through the app, which is really cool and very convenient too. So you guys, their sale is 15% off, which is amazing for the hatch. Honestly, go take advantage of it site-wide, 15% off anything on their site. I'm going to leave a link down below for you guys. Um, it ends tomorrow, so October 26th. You guys have just today, really, if you want to grab one. And thank you so much to Hatch for sponsoring today's vlog. But I'm not going to wake up, wake up. I'm not ready. Let me have another day. Don't wait. Cause I'm happy, I'm not gonna wait No, no, not yet Whoa, no, not yet Whoa, no, no, not yet Whoa I'm afraid I'll end up nowhere They keep saying I'll be fine But how you know that I'll be there Alright guys, um I'm on my way to Target I have not been to Target in forever And honestly, I don't remember what I'm even going to Target for I wanted to look at costumes because um, Quentin wants to be Jack Skellington and I ordered his costume weeks ago and it still hasn't come and I, it's this whole thing and I ordered it from like Halloween, Spirit Halloween store um, and I have a feeling it's not going to come in time so I just want to get him like some kind of backup costume just in case. 
Um, I was gonna look at the fall decor, although I heard it's all Christmas stuff now. Still congested, by the way. And then I um, wanted to look at some baby stuff, and I was just gonna bring y'all along, see if I could find any goodies. And um, my hair, I don't know if you can tell, but it is so gray. Um, I wanna show you guys like exactly what I'm going for. I'm trying to make an appointment so my hair girl who I love is completely booked, unfortunately, till the end of the year and I need my hair like done soon. I was actually supposed to get it done with her a few weeks back but I had to cancel it. Um, so I'm looking for someone else in the Charlotte area. That was a weird text. I don't even have a pet. I just wanna show you guys, I found this on like hair, I'm sure so many of y'all follow hair by Chrissy. She's like, I feel like she's a hair goddess and I love everything she does. So I found this on her page. I want everything about this hair. I want all the layers, like the 90s, like I love how the 90s hair is back. So I want the big voluminous 90s hair with all the layers. I love the brown, like that shade of brown with like the low lights and all of that dimension. Oh my gosh, obsessed. So this is what I'm going for. So I'm trying to find someone who can do this. Um, hopefully I can get in soon, but. Oh, and also how cute is this? Little, I know we're leaving honey. I've got Trey in the back. Um, how cute is this um, felt bag, fanny pack, whatever you wanna call it. It's from Lululemon and it's like got like the faux I don't know if the, oh, Sherpa, that's what it's called. It's got the Sherpa on it, and they have a few different colors, but I grabbed the white. It's so freaking cute. I love it. Um, I think they're out of stock a lot of the time, but I'll link it below if I can find them. We just got here, and Trey is snoring. He is fast asleep, so I really hope he sleeps while we're in Target. That would be ideal. I don't know. I have, like, the, um, the Duna. I have him in the Duna, and it's like, I guess I'm going to put the car seat in the cart because I can't stroll a cart and the Duna at the same time and there's no storage in the Duna so like I can't put anything in it while I'm in the store so I guess I'm just gonna like put the car seat in the stroller or in the cart I don't know if you're supposed to do that I feel like I used to do that with um, the other boys but I can't remember it's been years so um oh I want to show you guys these earrings Aren't these so freaking cute? They're like huggies, but they're like, I have like fat earlobes. Like I have big earlobes, <laughs> um, but they're like little huggies and they're kind of like squares. So cute. But I'm not gonna wake up, wake up. I'm not ready, let me have another day. Don't wake up, wake up. Keep it steady cause I'm happy, I'm not gonna wake up. first one is the first one I got eyelash glue on was my 90s sweatshirt the like merch that I created so it's like one of my favorite sweatshirts ever and I got eyelash glue on it and this one I just got from this really cute small shop called right here at home I love all of her pullovers she just sent me this beautiful like taupe one and first time I'm wearing it and I got eyelash glue on it I don't know what's happening um and I don't know how to get it off I need to like I asked y'all on Instagram and a ton of people told me like what to do so I need to like go back and look at that because I never did that with my 90s sweatshirt it's still on there I haven't cleaned it yet and now that I have it on too I'm like okay I have to do something so anyway I'm gonna show you all what I got from Target I swear like <laughs> I was in there for an hour and I barely got anything and it, I spent over $200 I'm like what just happened I wanted to get some groceries which I didn't get 
I wanted to get a bunch of things for um, Trey's nursery because I'm trying to put that together soon. Um, his wallpaper's up and like we just need the crib built. Uh, my girlfriend's coming over and we're going to paint the dresser. So the dresser that is in there right now that's Quentin's, it's going to be Trey's and it's like a French gray color but it doesn't go with the colors of Trey's room. Um, so we're going to paint it and put new knobs on it. I'm so excited. I ordered all the stuff that we need. Um, I want to do like a little cute book like nook area and I think I want to get like acrylic shelves like floating shelves to put on the wall next to the glider the new gliders in there as well I cannot wait to show you so cute um the rugs here like I have all the things I just need to get it all set up and put together I want to put the curtains up um have the curtains everything so anyway I went to Target because I wanted to just get like a few things just to fill in the gaps you know I bought a really cute basket right here I'll show you guys um but like I just didn't my brain was like I couldn't concentrate because I knew that I had to leave soon to pick up Camden from school I had Trey with me and he was he slept for most of the time honestly but he did wake up a couple times and get a little fussy so I was like trying to rush and also I didn't make a list and I feel like if you go to Target you have to make a list otherwise you walk out there with all the crap you didn't need and nothing that you did so anyway <laughs> there's my little talk um, I'm going to show you guys what I did get, but I spent way too much money and I feel like I got nothing. So, um, also I got a lot of pajamas and I feel like pajamas are so expensive. I don't know why. Um, so I got Trey some of these like fleece Carter's pajamas. I used to put Camden and Quentin in these nonstop during the winter months because they're so warm and they're zip up and they're easy to throw on. Um, and how cute is this little football one with like the little football feet? This is, oh my god, this is nine month. <laughs> I thought this was six month. This is nine month. But Trey's, Trey's pretty big. He's pretty chunky, so maybe this will fit him in a couple months. I don't know. Maybe I'll return it. I can't. I can't, you guys. All right, let's see. Where's the other one? Is this nine too? No, this one's six months. Okay, so this one is a cute little dinosaur one. I love the colors, like the sage green. It's got little dinosaur feet, and this is six months. This is the size that I think would fit him. Um, I got Camden some PJs. These are also from Carter's. These are size seven. Um, so it's got this one with, like, the hot dog and football and all that cute stuff on it, matching pants. And then there's another set. So cute. With these pants. Okay, so for Trey, I picked out a shark costume for him because that's literally all that was left in his size. In zero to six months, the only costume that was left in Target was the shark. And it's really cute, but I'm already debating returning it and just getting something from Amazon because I'm, it's like, it's so random. Like, why is he a shark, you know? Like, and since he's my last baby, I want to do something cute for his first Halloween. Like with Camden, he was Elvis. I need to insert like a picture if I remember. He was the cutest little Elvis baby ever. With Quentin, I don't remember what he was. What was Quentin? Was he like a surfer? Oh my God, I don't remember. I'm gonna have to go back in my pictures and look. That's awful. Um, but I wanted Trey to be like a hamburger or something because he's just like so chunky and cute and like I feel like he'd be like a perfect little hamburger or like a pig or like um, even like a pumpkin. They had really cute pumpkins there but they didn't have his size. So I may just see if I can find something on Amazon. Um, but I just got this in case and it was on sale too. But how cute. Like, look at the picture. So cute. So, I might just try it on him and see how I feel. Okay. Um, this is the cute little basket that I got. It's from Pillow Fort. Um, it's just like a storage basket for Trey's room. I don't know what I'm going to put it in Put in it yet. Maybe just like his stuffed animals or a couple little blankets or something. Next up is pretty much my Halloween costume, also, no also known as pajamas. So... I told y'all I'm being oogie boogie and I found a really cute um, hat and so anyway I found these pants in Target I actually have these in the mob color these are pajama pants and they're so freaking comfortable so I figured I would just get them anyway even if I don't use them for the costume um, they're like wide leg and they're like super soft stretchy I love them like I love my mob ones and I think this color is beautiful so anyway I grabbed these in a small they're pretty long um and then I showed you guys this in the store um the pants like looked too big so I didn't get the pants but I got the cute little sweater and I can wear it with this 
with a little beanie um, boogie boogie face or I got these um, green ones which I don't really know I thought these were cute anyway they're like corduroy stretchy pants and they're like they flare at the bottom I need to try them on but I thought these were cute too so um, oh one more thing last but not least I got Quentin a new little spider-man sweatshirt um, I showed you all this in the store but how freaking cute is this I love this color this taupe color um, okay so that's everything and that's that's all I got you guys it was so expensive okay so I'm gonna do a quick grocery haul I just got this um, th through Instacart but I got everything from Publix I'm gonna start over here we got some um, mandarin oranges the non bread that we love we make pizzas with this and then these are the buns that we get the hamburger buns from pretzella are so good and then we also do the sausage buns but i usually put the boys hot dogs on these some siete sea salt chips siete is like the best brand for chips everything i buy is siete pretty much um and then i love this busy cold brew the unsweetened it's organic it's so good i recently discovered this and i put my silk dairy-free pumpkin spice creamer in it and that's what i have like pretty much every day some ice cream cones. I got the boys some Kodiak cinnamon waffles for breakfast. And they also love the pumpkin spice waffles. Some cereal, um, oatmeal squares, brown sugar, and then the honey and oats multigrain. Picked up some organic honey crisp apples. The boys love apples. And then a bunch of berries, as always. Um, <clears throat> So Alex has been into beef jerky lately, so I got him the Jack Links one, but I am I always try to get the grass-fed for myself. He doesn't like this one, so I got the Archer's grass-fed beef jerky, the teriyaki flavor, some brown rice. These are the hot dogs that I get for the boys, the organic Applegate ones, and then I got a couple of these Lara bars, the peanut butter chocolate chip. These are really good just for on the go. These are my favorite almonds, the Blue Diamond Honey Roasted. They're so good. Quentin really likes these too. Um, and then a uh, cereal I've really been into lately is the Catalina Crunch, the dark chocolate one. This is amazing. I usually just eat it with almond milk because I can't have dairy or I'll put it in my um, dairy-free yogurt that I'll show you guys in a second. Got some maple syrup, some Annie's Organic white cheddar white cheddar shells mac and cheese the boys love this and then i got two red wines from apothic love this brand and the pinot noir i discovered recently and this is so good if you like that kind of wine it's really good um our favorite bread is the dave's i love the good seed so i picked up that some siggy's kids yogurt the avocado mash i've been getting these lately they're just really convenient they have just sea salt and um, black pepper in them but to make guacamole or to do avocado toast it's just i don't know i like just grabbing this i also did get avocados too and then this is the yogurt that alex eats got some Kerrygold butter some eggs these are the um yogurts that i'm eating the plant-based coconut blend siggy's i get the strawberry and then I also like the vanilla cinnamon. Um, and then we got some bananas. Um, picked up some ice cream. I had to throw it in here before it melted. And I have to redo my freezer because it's a mess. This is the dairy-free um, dark chocolate. I've showed this before. This is so good. So I got another one of those. And then I got this for the boys to try. This is organic cookies and cream ice cream. So hopefully that's good. And then I also picked up these um, little mini square vanilla uh, ice cream sandwiches too for them to try. 